before generating the actual decision tree, we have to define the output values. We want to identify these four different classes, but of course our sensor is able to return an 8-bit value associated with a single decision tree output. So here we just need to define what is the corresponding output that is associated with the string used. Steady, we're going to use 0, writing 8, idle 4, and other 12. Now, decision tree can be generated directly here using Unicode just by pressing the generate button. But of course, it can also be generated using external tools if needed. Weka, Python, or MATLAB can also be used for this. And here I'm going to show you how to perform that using Weka as example. Let's just generate the decision tree with Unico. Here, the decision tree has been created and the location of the decision tree has already been filled with the device, the decision tree that Unico has generated. In case of decision tree generated externally, here we have to upload and choose the decision tree that is created with the external tool. Now let's talk about Weka. Weka is a collection of machine learning algorithms for data mining tasks. It contains tools for data preparation, classification, regression, and visualization. With Weka Explorer, we first import the data file, ARFF file, that has been generated by Unico GUI. Then, with the Classified tab, we choose the J48 algorithms under Decision Tree Classifiers. The Start button will be able in less than a few seconds to generate the prune tree. Much more information are available here. You can find, for example, the confusion matrix. And in the Visualize tab, we can actually observe the data distribution based on different features. This is particularly helpful in determining which feature is more important than another one. The prune tree can now be exported into a text file that will be used by Unico GUI again to generate the register's configuration for your LSM 6DSO X. Now that the decision tree has been created and stored, it can be used to generate the register's configuration through Unico GUI.